everyone! Today I will be showing you how to make a farm scene birthday card. For this card, I started off by using the Cricut Country Life cartridge and cut out the barn and its coordinating pieces. Once the barn was cut out, I used my colors and no markers to color in the barn. Since this barn had a big area, I decided to use my chisel end of my marker to make it go faster. After half of the barn was colored in, I decided to use my black marker to add a roof to the top. The cartridge does cut out a little roof to go on top, but when cutting it out, it was too thin in certain areas and it kept breaking. Following the roof being added, I finished coloring the other half of the barn and then set it aside. Next, I grabbed the barn background and started coloring in the grass again, using the chisel tip to help it go faster. After that, I cut out the fence for the scene and colored them in using my brown sharpie marker since the other markers I was using didn't come with that color. I then grabbed the barn I had previously set aside and attached it to the background using some Elmer's clear liquid glue. I also attached the fences at the same time. Once the fences were attached, I set it aside and colored in the barn door and the silo roof, both in black, to go along with the barn roof. Next, I attached the door, silo, and silo roof to the background. Following everything being attached to the barn background, I colored in the weather main and added some yellow to the windows to make it look like someone was in the barn working. When adding the yellow to the silo window, some of it accidentally got onto the silo outside. To fix the silo mistake, I colored it in light gray to hide the yellow marker. Once the silo was colored in, you would never know any yellow got on the outside. After everything was colored in, I set it aside for later. I used the same cartridge again to cut out the farmer and his coordinating pieces. For his overalls, I colored them in dark blue. I then went on to his shirt and colored it in light blue. For the shovel, it comes with a handle on the bottom. I didn't end up using the pieces since they were too small and the glue would seep out and not hold well, so I ended up coloring it in. Once everything was colored in, I attached them to the farmer and then attached him to the fence. At this point, I didn't realize that my camera was out of focus. I cut out a cow and its coordinating pieces. For the background of the cow, I colored it in all black using the chisel tip of the marker. And then, attached the white to the front so that the black spots showed through and looked like a Holstein cow.
Following everything being colored in, I was ready to start building my scene on the card base. I started attaching the images to the card base. I added some blue for the sky and some green for the rest of the grass. I then attached the barn and the cow. To help finish the card off, I added two clouds, one on each side, and then thought the card looked complete. Thanks for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Also, a list of the products used will be down below in the more info box.